Okay, I have chosen eight Shelley Davies puzzles and one extra Shelley Davies puzzle that's not on the wheel, and you'll see why in the coming days. So, I don't know why I have copy of Color Davies. I gotta delete those two. But Shelley Davies, I have eight puzzles picked out. I'm just gonna change the setting just a little bit so you can see everything that's in, in the shot. I'm gonna save this and I'm gonna spin the wheel. And I have elements, air, elements, water, board games, toys, sewing supplies, artist materials black and white rainbow and I think that's it so they're all eight Shelly Davies puzzles four from Cobble Hill four from Schmidt and at some point today I will start one of them so let's spin the wheel to see which one that is okay artist materials is the one that I selected so after I get back from my appointment today, I will start sorting this puzzle. And what's interesting is I did a different Shelley Davies puzzle like this that was a Cobble Hill, whereas this one is a Schmidt puzzle. And I'll show the comparisons between those at some future time. So as you can see, I used the Puzzle Tracker app to show that I completed this puzzle. And here is a quick slideshow of it. And then, of course, I will slow it down. Now, as mentioned in the outset of the video, I had eight Shelley Davies puzzles that I put on the wheel. And I purposefully did not put one of them on the wheel because I want to do it closer to the weekend. This puzzle was fun for me, especially because my grandson help me to sort the puzzle and to get a good start on it before he had it home. And if you know me, you know that I love collage puzzles. So this type of puzzle is absolutely perfect for me. It's the most gratifying type of puzzle that there is when it comes to just sitting down and letting the synapses in my brain connect and finding matches, 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 matches until I get the puzzle done. And the funny thing is, like I mentioned, I did a version of this and it was a Cobble Hill puzzle. So I decided to go back into my archives and to find the version that was so similar to this because the artist is the same. The style is just a little bit different and you'll see that right now. So I thought it would be fun to just compare the two puzzles. They're both related to art. The Schmidt puzzle that this video is about is called Artist Materials. And this one is Vintage Art Supplies and it's a Cobble Hill puzzle. Obviously, because it's Shelley Davies, I've gotten really acclimated to her style because I did her Rainbow series. In fact, I still have two more puzzles to do black and white as far as rainbow gradient. But I wanted to see what the differences in the two art puzzles that she did for the different companies. And even though the style is different and the items on the puzzle picture itself are different, like you have uh, paint in little jars versus paint on a palette. You have pencils and even some brand name pencils are included in this version of this vintage art supplies puzzle. And I tell you, it was a lot of fun, especially since the wheel decided that I needed to do this version of Shelley Davies art puzzle again. So as you're seeing, I'm closing out the video with the artist material, materials, plural, puzzle from Schmidt. I believe this is the second Schmidt puzzle I have. And by far the majority of Schmidt puzzles I have in my collection are Shelley Davies puzzles. I want to thank you for watching and I look forward to seeing you with my next video.